With a no-code development platform such as GW Apps, you can build web applications in less time and with absolute ease of use. This application consists of forms, workflows and approval, security based on roles, and reports. So in this short video, I'm going to be creating a time tracking application. To create a form, simply assign a name like daily timesheet. The first section is going to be consultant details. And I can use two, three, or four columns layout. For this section, I'm going to use two columns layout. And then I can drag and drop the fields that I need in my form. So the first one is going to be a text field, which is going to be the name. I'm going to have a second one, which is going to be the date. And this is for the activity date. Okay. So I can change the label for each field. And probably I need the email address for this consultant. So I have my first section. I can uh, drag and drop a new section, which is going to be the activity details. And then I will use a three columns layout for this section. Okay. And in this section, I'm going to use a list selection for clients. And I'm going to use another list selection for projects. So I can set up clients and I can set up projects for my users to select from that list. And the last uh, field that I'm going to use here is a number, and this is going to be for the number of hours. Okay, and that is how easy you can, uh, you can add sections to your forms and fields based on your needs. I can add workflows or approval processes to my forms. So for the time tracking, I need an approval process for the hours that a consultant has reported. So I will move to workflow, and then I can add a new stage, like in review, for instance. Status is going to be in review as well. And then I will configure the workflow. So in the first stage, I'm going to say that when people hit the submit button, this record is going to change to in review. And then I save my changes. In the next stage in review, I want to add a new button to approve. Once people click on the approve button, this record is going to be changed to completed. And that's how easy you can configure a workflow. You can add as many stages as you need. You can also configure conditional stages, etc.